This conference will now be recorded. Hello friends, welcome to drpsolutions.com. My name is Sumit and here I am with my new video in Python machine learning. And the topic for today's video is that how to use external chat script with chatterbot or chatbot within Python. So in my previous video, you have gone through that how to configure chatterbot in our environment and how to test an inline script. So in this video, for this video, I'm going to take a business requirement and that's a live business requirement, which we use to implement in our BISP company. The requirement is that whenever a candidate connected on live chat and they inquire about one of our course, so our live chat agent will connect, communicate with them and respond back to the client, to the candidate. And after successful completion of conversation, at the end, we will send him detail on his mail ID, which is which we collect from the candidate in the beginning of the conversation. So we try to automate all this stuff to release the load from our marketing team. Otherwise, our marketing team, they have to send the details, further details manually to every candidate which connects with us. So in this case, the Chatterbot, we, have, we are using Chatterbot as a live agent and we would be invoking external script for conversation. So let me show you the external script. So that's the external script. And it's quite simple. You have to create an external script. So as you can see, my external script name is chat1.txt. And I have written some few conversation like, hello, now nice to hear you, meet you online. How may I help you? Good morning, very good morning. Now these conversation are in response and request. So whenever, for example, if, I'm, if I say good morning, so I would get a response from the chatterbot, very good morning. So being a candidate, I would be, that's the script, that's the uh, message or content which I would be writing, I would be typing, and that's the response which we'll be receiving from the chatterbot. So I'm looking for online training. Then again, we got a question, which course are you looking for? So we designed it for only for one course right now for Salesforce developer. And are you looking for yourself or a team or for learner in your company? So I'll just make this like self. So then I'll get you complete details and best discounted price. I need some help. Sure, how may I help you? How about course? So that's the details about the course. Then uh, in this, is this online or classroom training course? So these are some, these are few common conversation which used to take place between our marketing team and the candidate. So we have tried to replicate the same thing with Chatterbot. And let me show you the chatterbot script. So that's the script. And here, because at the end, I would be sending email as well. So I have added a script for, uh, I have, impl I have in, uh, implemented, imported the libraries for sending mails. So from chatterbot, import chatbot, list trainers, SMTP lib, and these are the libraries for managing emails. Then uh, I, just re I just call it as a BSP bot. And the script is chat1.txt. So here I have used chat1.txt. That's the location. And in this case, my Python file and the chat1 file, the script file resides on the same location. If your chat file is another location, you need to give your complete path, complete address for your file. Then uh, we said we add a set listener and we train the conversation as per the chatting script. According to the chatting script, we train the conversation. Now, as I mentioned that in the beginning, as soon as the conversation starts, I would be getting the details. I would like to capture the details from the candidate. So I ask them to enter their names, enter their phone and enter their mail ID. This mail ID and name we would be using at the end for sending email. And uh, I'll just print a message, print hello, name, welcome to BSP. That's a welcome message. This is Charles, how may I, how may I assist you today? Then uh, while true means this conversation keeps on going until and unless user did not end the conversation or close the conversation by himself or close the window or he did not and he did not mention or enter by in this step. So as soon as I, he as soon as he entered by, so 
from chatterbot will get a response as by and it will get terminated and whatever details he has entered according to him we would be sending details to him so that's a mail part which would be managing or handling the mails to so it, this will send an email to the uh, to the user so from user mail that's a user mail and from address so we enter the complete details here thanks for showing interest in developers training program and everything and once everything is okay will we are ready to test it so here text message server send mails server dot quit and thanks for connecting us and if any issue in the hand in if any issue in the mail mails mail part it will throw a, it will throw an error message now let's test this and in order to test this we need to execute this we need to run it so as soon as i run it there are two ways to run it uh, indentation okay just a second indentation i'll just look for indentation save it will load the chatter as a it will train the list trainer as per our conversation we have entered in the chat so it will take time to load as as per your number of scripts you have so it is asking for name so i just enter my name my phone number and my mail id and i enter my mail id so i just enter sumit.goel@bisbtrainings.com so you see i got a message hello sumit welcome to bisb training this is charles how may i assist you today i just write hello hi there i am looking for online training which course are you looking for i am looking for salesforce developer 1 are you looking for yourself or a team of learning your company so i am looking for myself so i just enter self here and let's see the response so then he asked for online training okay he responds online training after that i like uh, i just write i need some help sure how may i help you so then i write how about course so he just tell me about the details of the course that what we, what exactly will be going in this course what we are going to cover in this course then uh we have an information let's suppose uh, i just write i just raise another question being a candidate i raise another question how can i join so you have the option to attend the course remotely from your desktop via video conferencing this format say productivity challenge and decrease your time spent away from your home or work so these are the steps now i wanted to know the course fee so i just write a message i just raise a question how about course fee so i just got the details so total fee for this course is 17000 inr or 301 usd so and also i can raise a question can you send details on my mail or i'll say uh, thank you i just write uh, i just write thank you so you are welcome anything else no okay then bye and i enter bye and as soon as i enter bye it will process the script and it will uh, it will start the process for sending email on regist on candidate mail id and i got a message thank you for connecting us and the program has been terminated successfully now let's go and check my mailbox so as you can see i received an email from in my mailbox and first of all let me show you the details so from to date subject is thanks for connecting mail by bisp training and you can see that's the mail which i have drafted within the within python so that's the mail which i have drafted here that's the same that's the same message which i have drafted so it's a long message uh, we can also outsource this instead of instead of writing the script or the content within python code we can 
invoke this from external file as well so that's also possible that you can see in my previous videos where i have explained about how to send an attachment or how to send how to read the content from an external file through for sending an email so this chatter bot is now automated and as per my so in this case in this chatter bot we have used external script for sending and for so for responding or for raising some questions and will it will respond us accordingly so that's all in this program in this video if you have some queries you can visit our website www.bisptrainings.com you can post your comment in comment box or you can raise your question or you can directly mail to us also we are providing customized training on python mainly in machine learning so you can get more details visit our website to get more details on that thanks for watching have a nice day goodbye